Hey everyone and welcome back to the Redefine FX YouTube channel. So today I'll show you how to make translucent fabric material with Tyflo that lets light shine through. So I just have a very simple scene with a spherical V-ray light with the multiplier set to around 20. And I just have a simple Tyflo cloth simulation on top. So this is what it looks like rendered right now. Just very dark, no light going through. So what you can do in your material editor is just add a V-Ray two-sided material. And now we have some simple options for front and back material and to control the translucency of the fabric. So I'll just make another V-Ray material here. And let's just make it pure red for now to make it obvious how this works. So I'll set the red material as my front material. And let's apply this two-sided material straight to Tyflow. And here you go, right? So it's already working beautifully and the light is shining through the red fabric. And you can click on this translucency square and this is how you control how transparent it is. So pure black is not transparent at all. Pure white means completely um, transparent and you get something in between. So what I can do is also enable the back material. So that's literally what it means. It's the back side of the fabric. So I can make another V-Ray material here and maybe let's make this one pure blue. Again, just for illustrative purposes and connect that to the back material, right? So now what's happening is the back side of the fabric is blue and the front side is red, but because it's transparent, they are beautifully mixing together like this. So I can again control the translucency to control the strength of the effect to get some very cool results. So now if you want to control how reflective maybe the cloth is, you can always just go back to the front and back material and adjust the settings so I can boost the reflectivity of the cloth, maybe reduce the glossiness a little bit, right? I'm getting some nice reflections on the cloth and I can do the same thing for the backside uh, material as well. And just to get some nicer materials, I'm going to open the V-Ray uh, material browser here and use this curtain B01 material. So just right click and say apply to selected objects. Right. So this already is a two sided material that chaos has prepared for us. And if you want to change the tiling, you can just open the material, click on this diffuse map, scroll down to coordinates and set the tiling to maybe four by four and you're going to get a nicer pattern in the fabric, right? So this double sided means that the front material can be this pattern while the back material can maybe just be the blue color. So I'll just right click and cut this back material out and then just um, drag this blue material as the bag material, say instance. And it's a bit hard to see, but basically we are getting the pattern on the outside and then the blue color on the inside. And you can get some really interesting results this way. And you can, of course, also just increase the intensity of the light if you want something a bit more extreme. So I hope that you guys found this helpful. If you did, as always, I would appreciate a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll be uploading more. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.